Hey guys, this is Eric with D&E Miniature and Board Games. This is the second part to a three part that we we're doing with the upcoming Warpath. Kickstarter just ended a few months ago and Dead Zone about to be shipped out to uh, everybody that participated in that Kickstarter. What I'm doing is some unboxings of some of the older army boxes that you can still get on eBay and Mantic site to help kind of get started if you want to get your army started being built try out the new rules which you can get off the uh, Kickstarter on the updates you can download some of the rules you try these games out or you can just start beefing up your armies and getting ready so that when these Kickstarters hit you got part of your army already done today what we're going to do is the vermin battle set just like the enforcer set Well, this one actually comes with the old Warpath rules, too. Which I'm sure the Enforcer one had. I probably just didn't have it with it. So if you want to try out the old Warpath, this does have the old Warpath rule book. <clears throat> this one came with uh, your typical Mantic points. Looks like about three of them. Five dice. Thirty stands. Let's see what we got. Just like the Enforcer box, you have some metal pieces, different weapons, so forth. And what I will do is I'll break these out just like I did the Enforcer so you can see them. But basically what we have is, looks like about 30 vermin that you can put together. So you can beef up your army a little bit, okay? So just like with the Enforcer, this one has 10 night crawlers, 5 nightmares with chem burners, chemical drills, chem thrower and 10 stalkers including super drill and combat knives. Now like I said, if you just want to build up your Warpath or Dead Zone army, this is, you can do this, it's pretty simple. I think I got this for about 20-30 bucks on eBay. Like I said, you can still get it on the Mantic website. Not a lot to it really guys, it's just, it's just 30 figures. And it's Mantic's original so you haven't got a lot of different poses or anything. Um, as normal, you're going to put the bot. Looks like with the unlike the enforcers with the vermin, the bodies are complete. So all you got to do is put the arms and the heads on and decide what type of weapons you want with them. Okay. Oh, and you do have to add the tails. The tails are separate on these guys. So as always, guys, support your local gaming. We game at Tree Fort Games in Fayetteville, Georgia. And as always, guys, game on. <laughs>